In today's Minecraft EHC, we're going to be crafting the size shifting armor from Ant-Man. It's kind of like a tiny UHC, but where we can also become giant too, you guys will see what I mean. And of course, before we begin, you already know what we have to do. We're going to be looking into this chest because inside this chest is the like over today of 10,000 likes again. Okay, you know, we can do it. We always seem to hit it, so I appreciate you guys. And just because we always hit it, you already know what time it is. Here's another cute animal video. <laughs> Guys, we are almost to 600,000 subscribers. So if you guys are new to the channel and part of that 80% of people watching right now that are not subscribed, consider subscribing because not only does it help us reach our goal, but you'll be part of the best sub family and every sub counts. But besides that, guys, hope you all enjoy it and let's get straight into the video. All right, guys, and welcome to the first ever Ant-Man UHC where, yes, we're already tiny and everyone else is giant. And for some reason, these four right here, there's actually a fifth one when he logs back in, have Exostorio duck skins. It's terrifying. W why would you have an Exostorio duck skin? Anyways, though, guys, so for today's UHC, we're actually starting with Ant-Man's armor and going for tier three Ant-Man armor, which gives us the ability to not only go tiny, but really, really giant. So on the screen right now, you're going to see all the crafting recipes we need to actually make the tier three armor. We're going to be starting with the tier three chest plates so we don't have to worry about that but the pantalones the boots and the helmet is something we're going to be going for and it's mainly just going to take a lot of iron a lot of red dye and a lot of black dye so that's going to be our goal for today like the usual superhero uet and of course you already know we got the buy the x store lunar cape pickaxe sponsored by the x store lunar cape who would have thought and then we have this random chance cube which is probably going to end up killing me the rule is if we die to the chance cube we can keep playing all that being said let's grab all the items and i forgot to mention guys so something that's kind of cool and different for this uet is that we're actually in a bedrock box and there's no way to get out and you can't even dig out of it because uh there's bedrock right there too so to add to the beginning a little bit more we gotta go tiny and then we escape but with all that being said helmets off it's time to begin the uet here we go three two one good luck have fun and we're going tiny how do i go tiny again okay tiny no 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 oh gosh oh wait i forgot i gotta put on my helmet to actually not take damage dang it i just took so much damage all right we're gone guys we are a tiny nester and getting out of here it's probably better if i go for normal size yeah, let's do that. Okay, so right now I need squids and red roses and maybe some structures have good stuff. Oh, wait, there we go. I haven't seen the desert temple in forever. Okay, this could be really good. Oh, uh, wait, I have an idea. Wait a second. Hello, have a great day, guys. Wait, is someone already here? Wait, do they not see me? I love this. Oh, I don't take fall damage. Hopefully no one sees me. Golden apple. Um, Let's see, another golden apple and another golden apple. Okay, three golden apples is a good deal. Oh, someone's here, someone's here. I'm gonna get out of here. Not dealing with that and I am back to normal. Since we're kind of low in health right now, there is the rule that we can be revived if we die to this chance cube. For the content, we might as well break it now. Let's break it while we're tiny, just in case. Okay, please, please, please give me something good. Oh, wait. I just got a bunch of dogs. Oh, you're all mine. Oh, that's amazing. Okay, we have an army now. The thing is, I usually cave really... What? What? Huh? Wait, what just happened to my dogs? No, I don't like that. Wait, do I do it for the content? I'm never going to get that many creepers again. I'm doing it for the content. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. That was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. What the heck? Wait, does dying to them count as dying to the chance cubes? I kind of want to reset my health. We're doing it for the content. I need a reset of health. Boom. All right. All right, let's get out of here. We are back to normal. I need to get some red flowers and some squid ink ASAP. Wait, what is that? <gasps> Another village. Oh, wait. It's like a double village. What? Oh, it has a blacksmith and a book area. Okay. This is actually pretty solid for UAT. I still need red flowers and a lot of squid ink. So I'll see you guys once I find some because I'm kind of really, uh, I'm taking my time right now. What, what is this? Is this like a temple? There's so many new structures. I can't keep up. Come on. Give me your squid ink. One, two. Oh, I just need two. Okay. That's not that bad. All right. We got all the squid ink we need. What if I go giant? Oh. Well, that's a thing. Yeah, we're giant now. I didn't expect to get this thing that early, but I forgot I can just make myself giant manually. Back down we go. Okay, normal size. I like that better. I somehow still need to get red roses and then I'm just gonna go down and mine all the iron I can. All right, nine roads red. I think this should be enough after this one. 10 and six, that's more than enough. All right, time to cave, open for the best. I just gotta get as much iron as I can and make the new suit. Oh, okay. I mean, I really didn't need you, but I guess I'll take it. How do I have almost more diamonds than iron? Oh, there we go. Okay. All right. With that, we have 36 iron. I'm actually not sure if that's enough. I'm going to get like a stack and that maybe should be all we need. Let me go tiny right here. I have a little bit of a trick up my sleeve. Watch this. 10,000 IQ. You already know. All right. With all that being done, it's time to cook a lot of stuff and I'll see you guys once I'm ready to craft. All right, guys, it is time to craft. So the first few things I got to do is actually make a hammer. I think this is how I did it back in the day. Oh, there we go. Okay. Hammer. So now we just got to do this a lot of times. Like we need a lot of iron. I guess I'll use it all the way. Okay. Okay, 16 of these. We need red reinforced tripolymer and then black reinforced tripolymer. That's not too hard, I think. Okay, there we go. We got that done. Oh, there we go. Tier three Ant-Man's boots. So that's done. We have the chest plate and the boots ready. Now we just got to do the pantalones and helmet. Oh, I just did red reinforced. Oh, that's not too bad. Tier three Ant-Man's pants plus five armor. Love it. So now all we need is the tier one helmet. Glass panes. Got that. Got that. Got that. I just need iron plates. Oh, wait. 
Oh, I'm done. Wow, that was a lot easier than I thought. And with all that being done, guys, we have the full tier three Ant-Man set. I actually don't remember that much what all it does. And I don't know why I have these black particles all over me. It's kind of terrifying. I feel like I'm going to be radiated soon. So let's put it on real quick. And there we go. Oh, this is sick. So let's see. With Ant-Man, we have Shrink Infinite, Grow Infinite, Regulator, and the Shrink Suit. Oh, wait, I forgot to show you guys. So yeah, if I press prior, my suit goes actually into a tiny suit. <laughs> I'm a tiny me. And I can take off the helmet still. Oh, the helmet goes all the way off what all right let's get some obsidian and then i'll see you guys in a bit all right let's do obsidian and enchant table done easy easy enchant table my life and can we enchant the ant-man armor that's the real question oh we can enchant the ant-man armor oh that's sick let's see um protection one protection one protection one and oh i need a little bit more levels dang it Give me the levels games. Oh, wow. I'm x ring. I mean, it's a great source of levels, so I'll take it. Give me sharpness one. There we go. And enchant the pantalones. Protection one. There we go. Sharpness one, maybe. Oh, there we go. Okay. And sharp two. There we go. Sharpness two diamond. All right, guys. So I was going to go to the surface to test this, but I know it's a bad idea, but I kind of want to go giant in this giant hole right by the radiation. We're doing it for science. Here we go. Three. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay. I won't. I won't. I won't. I won't. Oh, and we're back. Okay. All right. So I'm going to take that as a sign of not going giant underground. I guess that's that was a little bit too cursed for the game. Game. Let's try out being giant. Here we go. Oh, what? Oh my gosh, we're really big. Okay, I didn't expect to be that big. All right, let's go back to our normal size. So if I go tiny, is it easier to hit mobs? Oh my gosh, it's actually broken. So with that, guys, I think we really did everything we needed to do this UET. Actually, we could go to a dungeon right now and try to get some strength potions. I completely forgot that there was one right under us, so might as well do that until PvP starts. But I think I'm going to play a little bit smart and go into a tiny, because mobs really can't hit me that easily when I'm tiny. Down we go, down we go. Give me the good stuff. <gasps> okay, this is it. This is it. Tiny X story was here. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 okay. Maybe tiny wasn't the best move. Okay, I'm gonna go tiny right here. Go away. Give me the chest. Um, speed two. Okay, speed two is nice. All right, this armor is not that good, but we did get an instant healing potion, so we can't die now. Hopefully, not jinxing that. Let's try to find some more chests. All I need now is a strength two potion. If I get a strength two potion, I'm chilling. I can two hit people. Win the UET. Be like, thank you guys for watching. Play the outro, and then be like, be sure to subscribe and all that good stuff. You already know. Oh, no, no, no. Why is it so easy to get stuck in lava? By the way, fun fact, guys, I am five foot like six, so I'm probably the shortest YouTuber you guys watch. So uh, it's very nice just being tiny in actual UET. <gasps> okay. All right. You know, th that's awesome. If I don't see the mobs, they can't kill me, right? Maybe it's not the best time to be tiny right here. Actually, it's kind of efficient. I like this. Look how easy we can get to the chest. Laudium, I think this actually gives you healing. Might as well drink it. And might as well now, since we kind of have it. Sharpness four diamond sounds really nice right about now. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna grab that and I'm gonna make a sharpness five. Fire is oh my gosh. This is why we go back down to the dungeons, guys. Oh my gosh, sharpness five. 11 levels for fire aspect two. Okay, let's go back to normal size. I'm kind of being annoyed of just being tiny. Um, I need 11 levels and with that, we have fire aspect two. Let's go. Fire aspect two. We literally have the best sword possible. I don't like the knockback two for PvP too much because it's harder to get combos, but fire aspect two is fire aspect two, so. Oh, this is the room. This is the room. Don't tell me it's looted. Don't tell me it's looted. <gasps> I don't know what that is, but it sounds cool. Another instant healing too. We are stacked right now. Like what the heck? Protection for <gasps> protection for. Okay. Yeah, that's actually kind of sick. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm so close to the chest. Please, please, please. I've gone all game just going for this thing. I'm a big instant healing two guy. Love instant healing. Best potion in the game. All right. So no strength two potions, man. But after all that, I am just going to run away. I am not dealing with you guys. It is about to be PP time. I can make a protection for piece and then we're going to try our best to just kill everyone. There's one more chest right here two more chests actually yes finally i was about to give up going for this potion no 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 okay okay we got it strength two sharpness five fire aspect two we're chilling guys time to go pp i'll see you guys in a bit oh wait guys i completely forgot to make one thing so before we start the pp i actually can go out and make shrink discs and then i can also make some growth discs so i wonder what the growth disc if we go up to these sheep right here giant sheep giant sheep can we get five likes for the giant sheep and now Tiny sheep. Wait, can I throw this at you? <gasps> oh, oh no. Oh no, Adrian. No, no, no. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You're back. You're back. You're back. There you go. A giant Adrian. There we go. This should be a really fun PvP portion. And do I still have the anvil? I do. Okay. Protection four. There we go. We have 11 golden apples for PvP, two regen potions, four speed potions, a strength two potion, sharpness five, power four, and a bunch of stuff that I can mess around with. All right, guys, it is that time again. We are tiny right now on top of this village church. And the final battle will be in this village with tiny, giant, and normal sized Ant Man armor people. And then Electric Extraction is just running around. My goodness. Anyways, though, you already know what time it is start the pp music and here we go in three two one go like have fun drinking my potions and hello oh i fell i fell um giant villager you can't see me if there's giant villager why do i feel like the giant versions of people are gonna just kill me instantly i'm going in i'm killing him oh oh my god oh 
Okay, that was like David and Goliath. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, that's one way to do it. Sharpness three. He had so many good potions. All right, let's just chill out for a second. And uh, let's go a little bit big for a second. All right, I'm trying to see if I can spot anyone. <laughs> the Why is that giant villager dying on the ground? Where are the people at? Are people hiding? No. No, that's karma. No, I didn't even see him. What? Oh my goodness, guys. No, what? All right, you can't win them all. Well, that happened. So a tiny JDL, is he invisible? Oh, wait, no, he's not invisible. He's just tiny. They're having a tiny fight. Oh, this doesn't look right. What? Okay, my man is speeding. J-Bug is going. Like, look at him go. Oh no, Kuri died. It's JD versus J-Bug. Oh. Jaybug said. All right, guys. So I just realized JD Awesome is going to be the winner for this UHC. Karina was the final kill. No. Or no, Jaybug was. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys all enjoyed. That's going to be the Ant-Man UHC. That, that was something else, guys. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Have a great one. Be sure to subscribe if you guys want to see more videos like this one. And let me know in the comments down below what other heroes, villains, anti-heroes I should do next. Or just characters in general. I can even do the avatar or something. But yeah, guys. Here's a playlist of videos just like this one. Bye, guys.